Okay, so let me take a guess. You're a controller player who wants to get better at the game. As most of you know, I'm known for having some very meme-filled controller videos. They all did really well, and I want to thank the controller community for that. But before I give some very helpful tips on how to be better, just remember that I am not a controller player. I just know a lot about gaming on controllers. Okay, let's get started. First thing we need to get out of the way is sensitivity. As I've stated in the past, adjust your sensitivity and your FOV to your desire. Sometimes all it takes is a sensitivity or FOV adjust to become a lot better at the game. Next, we need to look at our button bindings. In case you guys didn't know, you can actually rearrange your hotkeys on your controller. This means that you can go into your controller settings and switch up your hotkeys however you would like. Here are my recommendations. I actually switched my hit and placed hotkeys for my triggers to my bumpers. This means that on an Xbox controller, I placed with LB and hit with RB, and on a PlayStation controller, I placed with L1 and hit with R1. I also crouch with my left joystick when I press it down. I drop my items with B on an Xbox controller and circle on a PlayStation controller. And everything else is just about default. Now here are some extra tips that you may need. There is a gripping method on controller called the claw method. As you can visually see on the screen, you form a claw with your hand in order to reach multiple buttons at once. If you guys would like a separate tutorial video on how to do this, be sure to leave a like on this video. Also, experiment with your hotkeys on your controller. Not everybody is the same, so it simply takes some experimenting to get it right. You could also buy one of those controllers that have the bumpers on the back of them. These extra bumpers work as extra hotkeys. So it's like a Logitech mouse, where the mouse has multiple buttons on it that can be assigned to keybinds. I highly recommend scuff controllers they are kind of expensive but they work really well for professional gaming if you guys have any questions drop them down below consider leaving a like on the video and i hope you guys enjoyed